everyone. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I am going to do your daily messages for Thursday, December 7th, 2017. I hope you are all doing well. What beautiful cards. Wow, so the Wheel of Fortune. So this is you today. The wheel turning in your favor. Big changes happening for you that are better than what you're in now that are meant to be. There is clarity involved with all of this too, with the Ace of Swords. Clarity, truth, honesty coming to you. You could receive communication today that puts everything in balance with the Temperance card. Some of you may be dealing with a Sagittarius I do feel like a lot of you have to be patient, right? Just right now, things are progressing and turning in your favor. You're feeling very positive about things, about yourself. Things are coming to you. There are new beginnings, and that is also going to create harmony within your life. I do feel a very balanced situation here. Very balanced But you have got to make sure that you are paying attention. You, you are in a beautiful, divinely guided spot right now with both of these cards. I mean, temperance, that's your guardian angel guiding, protecting you on, on the path that you're meant to be on. The wheel of fortune is just karma, destiny, things happening the way that they are meant to happen and today is the seventh which is a spiritual day which is spiritual and which is a spiritual number it's a divine timing number wow that cannot be a coincidence okay um that's just beautiful and that literally just hit me I do find the need to strongly tell you to really pay attention today. Pay, pay, pay very close attention to things that people say, you know, to you today. Also read between the lines, the, that type of stuff, because I feel like this really could help you in the future with your future progressions. And, you know, all of these cards reduce down to the number six. And for me, that's harmony, peace, nurturing. And again, I hate to repeat myself, but absolutely pay attention to the messages that are coming in from others. Paying attention really is the key here today. All right, so um, additional guidance card, um, oracle card, if you want to, we'll see. These are the vice versa tarot. I'm sure you've seen them. Um, they're double-sided. So the only reason why I'm telling you this is because, you know, I've been doing this 27 years. In the book, it says, you know, you could leave it the way it comes out or flip it. It, you know, for me, it, you know, it's, so it's done the way it's always been, you know, you flip the card. So I'm going to flip it as if it had a back. Okay. So we have justice. Um, in the upright, this would be kind of like the reverse, but we have this side. So again, pay attention you're definitely, I mean, you have a, look at the sword in your hand here, in this card, just like here. Use it. Get to the truth. Get to the heart of the matter. Get to the clarity. And again, pay attention. Just make, you know, and you're, you are making very good decisions. Just make sure that they're not based on your own ego.
But overall, I mean, very, very, very nice. All right, um, we're going to look at your love lives using um, the Tarot of Sexual Magic. Okay, this is big time love. Um, maybe even getting back together with someone. All right, the same with this card. Um, judgment. I mean, this is making things right. Like wiping the slate clean, second chances. You know, with the Ace of Swords, you know, this is, you know, feeling exposed, you know, exposing things, even in your love lives today, which really could be what this is saying too. It is I just feel like honestly being protected really with you know with the divine too you know really really being protected liberation I mean, really, it's just beautiful. I love it in this deck. Like, really, exp I, I really, somebody's doing that today. Because this is the situation for today. This is you, the situation, and the challenge. And for some of you, this definitely reflects your love life. With someone that really does love you. Like there's a big time love here. Look at the light again. You know, things being revealed. You know, talking things through, getting to the heart of the matter. This could be somebody from your past with the second chance with judgment. For some of you, it could be a Sag, maybe a Libra, but beautiful, beautiful energy. All right, guys, leave your comments. Let me know how it goes for you guys over the next few days. Two major arcana cards, too, that are both divinely guided, spiritual, divine timing on a divine timing day. That's not a coincidence. And this, oh gosh, and this reduces to an 11. Yeah, yeah, which is a twin flame day. A twin flame number. Beautiful, really. All right, guys, really, thank you for taking the time to view the video. Share this video because it's beautiful, really. On a divine timing day. I'm going to title it that too. I love it. All right, guys. Good luck. I love you guys. Have a beautiful day and I will see you back here soon. Take care. Bye-bye.